<laughs> just the next Final Fantasy game is based on the LMO. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, boom, diddy, doom, boom, ba doom, ba doom, doom, be, doom, doom, boom, to doom, to doom. Everybody pay attention to Eva. <laughs> <laughs> Did you catch that? Uh. There you go. Uh. Get that. Uh. Uh. Get that. Ooh, uh. get that. Yeah. Can you see them jiggle through there? Yes, you can, actually. LOL. L -O. Didn't you know tits had their own skeletal system? <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Great. Sweet. There she is, flying off. With, a, fly, with her titties all over the place. <laughs> Just fucking splattered all over the trees. <laughs> <laughs> Can you walk? Yeah. I have no legs. <laughs> <laughs> Stop being so insensitive. Debbie name amputated. <laughs> Maybe it's Maybelline. Here, I'll stab you. Here. Here. <laughs> Accidentally shoots you. Oh, fuck. I made another wound. Mouser. <laughs> when you're using a two hand grip, you have to be careful where you put your hand. The next 20 minutes is just <laughs> teaching Eva how to, like, That's tutorial hold a gun. about how to use a gun. Yeah. Right, let's see. <laughs> I'm shooting with the root beer. Yeah, can. DJ picked up his soda can and just started shooting. Shooting away. Wow, look at all my things. Just fucking splattered all over the fucking ground. Yeah. Did they really fall over? I guess so. Oh my god, did you just hurt her? Like, ah! I don't know. Well, I guess it wasn't important because they... Oh god! Cool. All right, come on, Eva. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. Come on, Eva. <laughs> so funny. Oh, Why man. the fuck? What's wrong with his... Like, in the in the cutscenes, he usually looks pretty cool. Yeah, but... But then you go and you play the game, and it's like, Snake, mode. what's wrong with you, Snake? Yeah, all right there, Snake. Snake and Snake. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on. I want to show you something. I want to show you something. Nope. I don't want to call you. It's my bitch. Let's just climb up here together. Delicious. Lip to <laughs> <laughs> Dylan Wong, come on, baby. Dylan Wong. Sorry, I named you Die Long that one time. <laughs> you remember that? Yeah, you'll forget about that. Yeah. I was telling DJ that the song Cheap Thrills by Sia has been stuck in my brain. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't. No, you, didn't you see saw nothing. nothing. You don't see nothing. You don't see anything. I'm a ninja. Mm. <clears throat> Would you believe me if I told you I was a ninja? Nope. Why not? Because I know who you are. Oh, that's fair. Great. Sweet. Fantastic. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> the coast is clear. Let's go. Oh, snake. Uh oh. It's you. Nice. Come on. Oh, you're right there. Good job. <clears throat> no, Good she's job. One step ahead. Good job, Garrett. You get a biscuit. Where's she? Come on, girl. Where the fuck are you? You, what, you, what, you want a fucking cookie? You want a fucking cookie? Yeah, I Here. think she wants a cookie. Here, take a fucking cookie. You ate, oh, you, you ate the cookie. It. You ate the cookie. Here, you get the nudes. Here, have some nudes. Have some nudes. Mmm, so good. Oh. So good. Oh, 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 my bad. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, <laughs> I just punched her right in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Health is still the same. Yeah. Oh, that's great. She knew it was an accident. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. 
I was just trying to back out of the menus instead. I was pressing B a bunch like right. that. Right. Oh my god. Uh, Eva, you crack me up, mm -hmm. you silly bitch. She's she's funny. She deserved it. <laughs> she deserved it. Yeah. Are there any baddies down here? I don't know, but let's use a box to find out. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. I won't punch you this time, I swear. Huh. Break your legs. <laughs> 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 uh, you. Cool. Nice. Thank you. And you. Nice. There's definitely some people laying down in the grass. I know Most there's likely. like some extra sneaky people over here. Yeah. I can believe that with this Come game. Well, oh, before I bitch slap you again. <laughs> before I give you some news <laughs> then I punch you. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. I'm surprised they didn't put like mines or whatever here. Yeah, that would be a interesting adventure. There's would. more people. I think there's one right there. I just wanna shoot him. Okay, 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 never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa! Oh, just kidding. We're leaving. <laughs> it's fucking punched you right in the face. <laughs> it looked like like a real like how you, how she would have reacted had I actually punched her in the face. Right. Yeah. Just as I once created the cobras. Oh, I have. I have Half they paying attention. <laughs> She's I pregnant. No longer be able to bear children, oh. But I still oh. <laughs> she, she had a child. It's so symbolic. Like, this game is like such an amazing love letter to like it the Metal Gear November series itself. Mm -hmm. Because um, I was in the Nevada desert. Like, this game is just so good. Like testing. the last boss of this game is the boss. And like you know the boss the from the very beginning of the game as one of your allies, Spanish. like she's like Covered she's talking snow, to you on the codex like before you even start your mission, and she's like wishing you luck out there and all this stuff. And, snow and is exactly she was like your mentor for a long time, like your mm -hmm. boss, and her name is the boss. And right. then at the end of the game, the boss is the boss, right? Mm. And then in the same thing, <clears throat> the very first Metal Gear before Metal Gear Solid, the very first Metal Gear game that Hideo Kojima made, he plays Solid Snake, mm -hmm. and you're talking to Big Boss, who we are. Yeah, you're talking to him on the codec call, and he's like coaching you through everything. He was your mentor, and then at the end of the game, Big Boss is the final boss. Oh wow, okay, interesting. We'll never have the chance to die peacefully of old age. Shame. We have That's a shame. Tomorrow. But we can still have hope for the future. Oh, it's Nick. <gasps> She's out of beard. Oh, God, that's gross. <laughs> I saw a vision of the ideal future. It's like Mara without a mustache. <laughs> Three I can't, years I can't. earlier, yeah, the Soviet Union succeeded in launching Sputnik, the first man made satellite in history, into orbit. Yeah, it was. This came as a huge shock to the United yeah, States. Yeah, it was. They were just in like, what response, the fuck? America threw everything <laughs> it had into its oh, own man. manned space flight project. Can't just throw the things Mercury into the space. Yeah, they, the uh, Kojima <laughs> talked about if he were to make a Metal Gear Solid 6, America was um, it would take place before Metal Gear Solid 3, and you would play as the boss. Oh, wow, really? Yeah. Sweet. Because the boss is one of the most interesting characters in the whole series. Like, this is why I'm saying you need to, like, play this whole game and, like, really, like, be paying attention mm -hmm. to a lot of it, because it's freaking insane. Well, you know what? We'll fund Hideo Kojima's Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> we'll just... Just you and me. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it with the money we make from video birds. Yep. So, jack shit. <laughs> but that's okay. After all, I'd already been irradiated once. Of course, you won't find any of this in the history books. I'll show you. I could see the planet as it appeared from space. It's symbolic as fuck. That is, yeah. <laughs> it finally hit me. Space exploration is nothing but another game in the power struggle it is. between the U.S. and the U.S.S.R. It was. Space is just Politics, nothing but a game. Economics, <laughs> the arms race. It's like Monopoly. They're all just arenas for <laughs> meaningless competition. I was just thinking, our I'm timer sure ended, uh, you know, the four minutes ago. Mm -hmm. I'm just imagining, what if instead of, like, going over time, we just stopped? No cold war. Like, we're like, okay, next time, I'm video verse. <laughs> just, like, mid-cut scenes. Right. The United States nah, I can't do that. <laughs> I mean, you can, you can only do that, if, like, if you're able to, well, no. I wouldn't want to, like, pause in the middle of a cutscene. 
In the 21st century, everyone will be able to see that we are all just inhabitants of a little celestial body called Earth. I thought that was already common knowledge. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. A world without communism or capitalism. It's excellent. That is the world I wanted to Hell see. yeah. Down with the communists. Fuck, fucking commies. But to I was about to say sorry to any commies watching this, but no. <laughs> In 1960, Sorry to any <laughs> neo-Nazis watching this. Oh, yeah, my, my fellow... No, I'm just <laughs> ...the CIA-sponsored invasion under the guise of taking Cuban exiles back to their... Not country. the Cubans. But the U.S. government betrayed them. Our weak-kneed president held back their air support. Defenseless, yeah. the exiles I, I would really were just love this for history class. Just give me a video game based on this historical yeah. <laughs> I was set up by the very country I'd sacrificed so much for. Like, can we get a video game based on the, the Alamo? <laughs> like, I'm tired of all these World War II games and World War One games. I want an Alamo game. <laughs> I'm trying to find out how Texas was born. <laughs> Call of Duty Alamo. <laughs> World, uh, what is it, the new Battlefield game? Battlefield 6, the Alamo. <laughs> nice. But one of us had to. <laughs> Just the next Final Fantasy game is based on the Alamo. <laughs> <laughs> An RPG. Yeah. It'd actually be really cool. Just like a Western RPG like set oh, at that time. The Sorrow. Oh. There is no enmity between us. She's talking about how they were lovers. One must live. <clears throat> oh. And one must die. Maybe that's probably why he was all sorrow, because they broke the up. <laughs> that's the why. Who gave me that mission were the philosophers. This is why another a bunch of other people also believe that uh, Death Stranding is all still just like an elaborate ruse, and Death Stranding is actually Metal, Metal Gear Solid 6. Because it's like, he said in the past, he's like, yeah, if I'm ever making the next Metal Gear Solid game after 5, it's gonna take place before MGS3, and... Uh, it's gonna tell the story of the boss After and all that, that stuff. I mean, you see Maz Mikkelsen and he's like the sorrow, right. and you see that trailer where everyone's walking around in World War II gear. I mean, there's still a possibility. <sighs> a lot of other people would just disagree, like, no, there's no more possibility. But I'm like, hey man, it's fucking so I mean, you never know. He's like a mastermind and like mind like, like the moment you pop up in the game, it's be like, welcome to Metal Gear Solid 6. Like, what? <laughs> The sacrifices of war cause a shift in the times. This shift leads to renewed conflict and in turn triggers the next war. Like the a console new war. reaction, each conflict sparks countless others, forming an endless spiral that will continue on for eternity. Man, if I was in Snake's shoes, I'd be like, whatever. <laughs> Been talking for like seven minutes. Let's go. Keep that cycle going forever. It was my father who explained all of this to me. Let me tell you all about my father's past. <laughs> one of them. You see, I am the last remaining child of the philosopher. <gasps> okay. But after he revealed the truth, my father was killed by that same shapeless, formless organization. Oh, yeah. And my father isn't the only thing the philosophers have taken from me. Mm. In June of 1944. June of 1944. What happened in June of 1944? This is where people think it's going to take place. We've been given a top secret mission to locate and destroy enemy V2 rocket installations. Okay. I was pregnant at the time. Oh, she a slut. She is. Sorrow was the father. Oh, oh, snap. I gave birth on the field of battle. Ah. Right in the middle of battle. Beautiful. <laughs> like guns and blazing just ah. But my child was snatched away from me. Yoink. <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs> Thank you. By the philosophers. Titty. Look at this scar. <laughs> this is proof that I was once a mother. Things are real weird. I gave up my body and my child. You stop life. masturbating right now, DJ. Sorry. There is nothing left inside me now. You, shouldn't she be dead? <laughs> Got no that bones. Was the case. Got no blood. <laughs> <laughs> no more organs. And yet sometimes at night, I can still feel the pain creeping up inside me. Yeah. Crawling in my skin. I hear this. It sounds like a band of some sorts. 
Lincoln. What? Lincoln. Was it? I've never talked Lincoln. this much about myself. Fart. Fart. <laughs> Lincoln Hart. And thanks for listening to me. You're welcome. No problem. I listened to you for about nine minutes and twenty-five seconds. I feel content. Sweet. Snake. The okay, computer. I raised you. <laughs> I loved you. I've given you weapons, taught you techniques. As a mother should. <clears throat> My mom sometimes she just hands me a RPG seven. RPG seven. And I just go to town. Is my life by your own hand. One must die, and one must live. Okay. No victory, no defeat. Man, this, I wonder what Snake's thinking about right now. He's like, will you please just let me kill you? <laughs> the one who survives will inherit the title of boss. Oh. And the one who inherits the title of boss will be big. <laughs> They'll just get fucking huge. <laughs> you grow like two feet and gain 100 pounds. Migs will come and bomb the hell out of this place. Mm. If you can beat me in less than 10 minutes, you'll be able to escape in time. I win. <laughs> Let's make this the greatest 10 minutes of our lives, Jack. Okay. All right, guys. You're a soldier. Finish your mission. Prove your loyalty. Leading to this game. Of course, I was playing it all. Face me. You know, paying attention, yeah. you know. The ending of this game really fucked me up. <laughs> I bet, yeah. All right, All right guys. SMV versus the finale. Yeah, we beat the game. Yeah. All right, bye. Well, this is my song. I'm making up a song. This is a song with um, no rhythm or thong thongs. Songs and thongs, they rhyme. I'm looking at painting. I don't know. I'm sorry.